All right, good morning, good morning, good morning. Just chatting here with Gina before hitting record. I do want to remind you, if you haven't RSVP'd, please let me know if you're coming Saturday, one to four. We'll have different segments, different times, lots of great things to really work with our energy, some concentrated effort. So I hope you will join us. So today, as I was thinking of what I wanted to do, I really kind of wanted to use all of our tools and really work into the higher realms of possibilities, call in from the Akashic field of energy, our healing guides, and help us to release some of this last bit of winter. I know right here at the last bit, like we get excited and then we go into cold weather and it's like this compression, contraction. And so sometimes we can feel our energies drop right before spring. It's like this awakening. No, I don't like sometimes in the morning in the bed, it's like, I know I need to get up. I know I slept, but I'm so warm. I'm so comfortable, but I know I need to get up. I'm so, so we can have this feeling of contraction and release and then open them back. And so it can be confusing. And then we can attach to some of those lower vibrations. Oh, I'm never going to make it. I'm never going to get up. I'm never going to get out of here. I'm never going to reach my dreams, right? We can spiral. So what I wanted to do this morning is just work in some of the higher realms of possibilities, call on our guides, call on our angels, and allow the healing guides, with the help of the angels as well, through your higher self, to pull out any of those little threads that might be winding up in you as we start to really kind of open up from the winter energy. So just notice what you notice. Other times I'll say, turn a bright red. So if you feel like the fire, you feel like that worry, or you feel like that lesson energy or lack, like bring it up and imagine it red. And then we allow the healing guides just to pull those threads out. So notice what you notice. This is some of the Akashic work I do. So we will begin as we begin, finding something to light, calling in these sacred elements, lighting some fire, Allowing for that spark within you to open up. Noticing the element of air, cleansing the mind, cleansing the spirit, cleansing the space. Calling in the element of water, just let all those emotions loosen up. We're moving towards a full moon on Saturday. You might notice a little extra emotional energy coming in. Let it flow. No emotion is ever final. Calling in the element of earth. Grounding. Centering. Feeling that connection deep into the earth. And then we take a nice deep inhale. Bring in that breath up all the way through the body. Opening up into the higher realms. We open up this radiant channel. Exhale, pulling all this energy down, absolute light, streams of grace as you call all your energy into you, call it in. Taking another deep inhale, breathing up the body. Exhale, breathing all the way back down, call in the spirit, feel the alignment of the spiritual body right on top of the physical, the emotional, the mental bodies, all aligning, centering. Taking another deep inhale, breathing up the body. And as you exhale, just dropping right into the heart, right into the deepest part of your heart. Feel that connection, your spirit and the greater spirit. Know that you're loved, guided, protected. Feeling all this energy coming in around you, supporting you, guiding you. Just taking a moment, noticing where you are in this late part of the winter season. Feeling that energy for you. Just noticing, are you ready to open up a little more? To start processing all of those dreams from the winter. To start recognizing the seeds you want to plant. Or do you find yourself still caught in the cocoon? It's okay. We all have our different rate of opening up, but just noticing, no judgment, just noticing. Maybe you do want to stay in a little longer, get a few more extra dreams. Just notice, no judgment. Taking a deep inhale and exhale all the way down deep into the earth. And now let's just expand the orc field, opening up that energy all around you. 
and exhale, pulling it all the way back in. Inhale, expanding the breath, front, side, back. Holding the energy open for a moment, just noticing the energy behind you. Imagining just going through and cutting, releasing past energy, let it go, free it up, breathe. And then call the energy back into you. See if it feels a little lighter as the open up one more time. Inhale, expanding that energy. And exhale, coming right back into the center. Right here in the deepest part of the heart, we begin to move into the higher realms. Inhale, breathing up the body. Feeling that energy opening up. Call in the higher self. Feel the higher self coming in for you as we call in the masters, the teachers, call in the archangels. We're calling in the healing guides today to align with us, to help us. Feel all this energy coming in. And as you take that next inhale, imagine it moving through the body, through the crown, through the higher chakras, the higher self starting to move into the higher realms of possibility, into the Akashic energies. Feel that expansive light opening up to you. So we call in the healing guides to help us with any of this less than light energy. Calling in the healing guides to come in and help us release any of these threads that might be attaching to us. Using our Reiki symbols, Han Chen Se Shun Nen, Han Chen Se Shun Nen, Han Chen Se Shun Nen. Calling in through all of that energy, time, distance, space, light, calling it in. And then we use the Sehaki, 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 releasing out as we start to allow the healing guides to start pulling through, imagining these guides coming in. Anything that feels less than light, turning a bright red, this is what we want to do. Any of the fears, the stress, the worries, those lower vibrations of energy, imagining them being pulling out, releasing the fears, releasing the blocks. Notice where they show up in your body. We just love it. We don't judge it. And we just allow this energy to release. Feel the healing guides working around you, pulling out. Dropping the awareness right into the solar plexus for a moment, just noticing whatever's there. This is where we hold trauma, conditions, energies we pull in. So right here in the solar plexus, let's clean this energy out, allowing the healing guides to work right here, right in your solar plexus. Imagining pulling out these little threads, excess energies, whatever it may be for you. Pull it out. Take a deep breath. And now exhaling right through that solar plexus. Let it go. Right through there. And as you do feel, feel these little threads releasing. The guides are working with us right now. Imagining it releasing. Feeling a sense of lightness coming in. The energy of Archangel Sarah comes in to help us release that struggle, that stress, that pushing. Finding ease and effortlessness. Right there at the back of the solar plexus, right there above, above the adrenals, right there sitting on the adrenals actually, just those places of integration, releasing through the back, the guides release, and then the beautiful angel energy comes in. Ease and effortlessness as you move through this part of winter, freeing, releasing. All the judgments, no judgments, just noticing soul work, guiding you, let it go. That ease and effortlessness. Allow this vibration of energy to heart link with you through the heart, moving through the back body. We've had a lot of upgrades of energy. It is affecting the way we stand up, our DNA, the structure. So we're just going to ask for Ariel to come in. Help us to refresh the body. 
as we're growing, moving through our spiritual challenges, standing stronger, standing differently. Just imagine this beautiful golden cord of light coming now into your heart, heart linking with the angels. Let all of this energy come into you, breathing it in, feeling the lightness, the joy. Noticing through that lower body, the release, let it go. Notice the angels surrounding us, a little floating sensation. Take a deep inhale and exhale. We just ask anything else, ask the guides, anything else, release. You feel a little more moving out through the back body, through those adrenals, we just clear it out. It accumulates here without even trying. You're just pulling it out, pulling it out. Release. Let go. Breathe. Noticing a sense of lightness as we bring even more absolute light all the way down, pure light, filling in those holes that the angels and the healing guides help to release, filling it in, absolute light, absolute light, new possibilities, new fresh energy moving through as we transmute it out the old, helping you to process, to integrate dreams from the winter, Consciously or unconsciously, many times we don't even know our dreams. Trust, they are coming through as we make space. Clearing old energies out, absolute light coming in. Just taking a few more moments, sitting in this vibration of energy, let the healing guides do the work for us. Breathe, release. Anything else that feels troublesome, right red, turn a bright red, let the guides help to find it. Feeling the release, lower body. I'm feeling a lot of that energy through the lower body, through the solar plexus, all the way down. Breathe. Clearing out, it feels like it's going like this, all the way down. Breathe all the way through the hips, the legs, the knees, the feet. Archangel Michael's coming in, helping us feel that sense of protection, abundance, him surrounding us all around us in joy. Beautiful angels of light, breathe. <sighs> Release it out and moving it through the knees is where we're at right now. It's what it feels like, the lower legs, the feet. Let it go so you can soar and fly. Finish the dreaming time so that you can process all of this energy through the DNA, through the energy body, creating this new possibility for manifesting seeds in the spring. exhaling all the way down many messages come in right now for all of us even amongst the chaos in the world find your light there is abundance in that energy of light for you allow your vibration to remain lifted and even noticing when you find that energy taking you out of this vibration you breathe, you call back this light to you, 
There is struggle in the world right now. There is a sense of lack and we want to raise that vibration and be in alignment with Mother Earth. She is starting to bloom. Bring that vibration in for you. Taking one more moment or two here. And with the integration energy of Archangel Michael, just releasing any last bit of fear you may be holding. Inhaling and exhaling, coming back into the heart. And right here in the deepest part of the heart, we just do a little heart linking, thumb and middle finger come together, both hands. And we just reach up to the angelic world, the angels, and bring it right into the heart. Opening up, sending some out to humanity, and then they're coming back into you. Feel this love, take it in, all this love, self-love for you that will radiate out around you, fill up the heart. Fill it up, imagining through this beautiful golden cord, the angel vibration of light and love. We are all connected. Feel this energy for you, opening up your heart, strong in the heart for you. Whatever troubles or transgressions you may be feeling, just know this vibration of light is here to help you find the light for you, to lift the vibration. Taking one more deep inhale and exhale, breathing all the way down as we start to bring our energy body, our radial light body all the way down. Feel this white light coming in, connecting us down deep with Mother Earth, sealing the energy in. Shokurei, shokurei, shokurei. Feel yourself grounding, landing. I just had that little sense of landing back here on earth. Inhaling and exhaling. And so from all of this beautiful high vibration, let's just tap it right into the body. I am light. I am love. I am strong. I am love. I am healthy. I am light, whatever your mantra is for you, continue tapping. I am full of angel love today. I am, I am guided. I am surrounded in love. I am love. I am totally protected in my light. The angels surround me. I am love. As I open my door to this day, I walk with my heart. I am light. One more time. I am light. I am. I am that infinite source of light through which all things are created. I am. Karate chop point. I choose to love and accept myself no matter what. Just release the hands, take a nice deep inhale. Notice how you feel, exhale. Little self-love, I love you, I love you. Just tell yourself, I love you, I love you, I love you so much, thank you. Thank you for releasing and opening up to the higher realms of possibility. <sighs> Bringing the hands right to the heart as we go to close, lots of gratitude. Feeling that gratitude all around for all your many blessings. Gratitude for this day, for opening up the light, for the connection you have, your spirit and the greater spirit, for showing up for you. Inhaling and exhaling all the way down deep into the earth, grounding, centering as we separate out our energies, coming back. One more deep inhale, open the heart, feel that third eye, and as you're ready, blink in the eyes, back open. So notice how you feel, carry this light with you all day long. To your spirit, namaste.